understand what multiples are, let's first consider the table of 2. If you look at all the numbers in the table of 2, like 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, all these numbers are called as multiples of 2. That means multiple of a number is a number that comes in its table or that is divisible by that number. How do you get a multiple? If you want to get a multiple of 2, you multiply 2 by any other number and then you get a multiple of 2. For example, if you multiply 2 by 3, you get 6 which is a multiple of 2 or if you multiply 2 by 5, you get 10 and 10 is also a multiple of 2. That means you multiply 2 by any other number to get a multiple of 2. Similarly, if you look at the table of 3, then all the numbers in the table of 3, like 3, 6, 9, 12, 15 and so on, are all called as multiples of the number 3. What it means is that if I get some number by multiplying 3 and another number, that number is always going to be multiple of 3. For example, when I multiply 3 and 10, 3 tens are 30, 30 is a multiple of 3. Why? Because 30 can be written as 3 multiplied by something. Now let's consider 3 multiplied by 5 equals 15. Since 15 can be written as 3 multiplied by 5, 15 is a multiple of 3 and 15 is also a multiple of 5. Now let's consider 3 multiplied by 4 equals 12. Since 3 4s are 12, 12 is a multiple of 3 and 12 is a multiple of 4 as well. But we know that 12 can also be written as 6 2s are 12, right? So I can write 2 multiplied by 6 equals 12. That means 12 is a multiple of 2 and 6 as well along with 3 and 4. That means 12 is a multiple of 3, 4, 2 and 6. Now let's go back to 15. We know 3 5s are 15. But can I also write 15 as 1 multiplied by 15? Yes. That means along with 3 and 5, 15 is a multiple of 1 and 15 as well. In case of 12, you can write 12 as 12 multiplied by 1. That means here as well, 12 is a multiple of 1 and 12 along with 3, 4, 2, 6. That means 12 is a multiple of 3, 4, 2, 6, 1 and 12. 